Yo, what's going on guys? Bobby here and we have an insane video for you guys. But before we get into this, we have two things that we need to cover. One is we're doing a Supercell box giveaway. Now, if you guys don't know what's in the Supercell box, a picture is going to be on the screen. It is very hard to obtain these. Only Supercell creators get them and they are very very rare we're going to be giving one away to a lucky subscriber so how to join is all you need to do is subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed right now very easy hit the sub if you don't have a youtube account make one it takes two seconds and subscribe because there is a lot of luck that goes into this and you really want this supercell box i don't know if i'm ever going to be able to give one away ever again so if you guys want that chance to enter, you guys already know what to do. Just hit that sub button and one random winner is going to be picked. And I'm just going to send them a DM and it's going to be that easy. Number two is I did a interview with a university group and it's going to be posted on the university website. And I'm going to be posting the link to that down in the description below. And if you guys are into business or into the behind the scenes YouTube and Brawl Stars, you guys can check that out. It's pretty interesting. It's not too long. So if you guys want to check that out, go ahead. And finally, what we are all here for today is some insane 2K Leon. Now, I haven't watched any of the games, so we're going to be going over them together. I got the clips. You guys can see my Leon is 525. I haven't played it in a very long time. And that kind of shows you guys how hard it is to be able to get a 2000 Leon. It is very far out of meta. I know it was done in Showdown, so we're going to be watching the games live. We're going to be breaking down how he did it. I'm going to give you guys some tips while doing so. But that is going to be it for this extremely long intro. So let's hop into the games and let's show you guys what's up. All right, guys, so here we go into the first game. Now, again, it's going to be some showdown gameplay. I don't know how it's going to go. But anyways, this guy who gave me this gameplay, he has a YouTube channel. I'm sure he posts tons of Leon content, posts of maybe showdown. I'm not sure, but he might be giving you guys some insane tips on how to do this. So if you guys want to do this, you know, link in the description below how it always is. But anyways, from what I'm seeing right now, he is not teaming. And that's a very good sign. Again, I'm watching this live with you, so I don't know how it's going to go. It looks like he's checking the bushes really well, which is something I suggest you guys to do. If you're playing duo showdown or solo showdown, just trying not to team. Just checking those bushes is a really good strategy. You don't ever want to walk into a bush blind because imagine he did. Imagine that Shelly was in the bush and he didn't check and he got Shelly super to the face. So anyone watching, you guys already know, very basic tip. Check those bushes, but he's doing a really good job. And I actually appreciate the fact that he's not teaming right now. He's doing everything legit from what I'm seeing. So this is really cool. Um, but anyways, this Leon's just going to be kind of chilling, you know, lurking. I think he did a little bit of a spin over there, like a little shimmy like that. I don't know what that means, but I don't think that's teaming. Oh, oh, maybe he's doing a little smiley face. Okay, I think the crow initiated that one. So we're going to give this one to the crow. But this Leon is playing this pretty legit from what I'm seeing. So what I can tell is he's not going into the middle of the pressure. He's kind of just chilling towards the outskirts and maybe just poking away. And that's kind of what you want to do with Leon. Although Leon has really good DPS, if you're going face to face with someone, you can't really control the outcome. Maybe they're close to super. Maybe they're not. Maybe somebody third parties you. So I wouldn't really recommend doing that in showdown. What this Leon doing is absolutely perfect. He's just chipping away slowly, slowly getting people weak. He, had, he has three power-ups, so it's not like he's a weak guy. And he can just poke away and see what happens. He's not going to be going to the mid. Looks like he's going to team up with that crow over there. That crow is going to put a sad face. He's actually not teaming. I, okay, this is pretty cool. He's actually not teaming. He's playing this fairly legitimately. I'm pretty sure he's teamed with that crow, though, over there. Um, he's teaming with that Shelly now. So it looks like his strategy is kind of just get a couple kills, try and get some boxes, be a little bit strong, and go for the dub. So I can appreciate that type of gameplay. He's not just, you know spinning with everyone from the start of the game i actually do enjoy that but anyways it looks like that shelly on the top right is going to go down looks like they got a big pinch on him and hopefully this leon will respect that crow and kill that carl before the crow goes down i don't know how this one's really going to go it looks like he is okay so he's a good guy this is a very good showdown gameplay and i can actually appreciate that i think that was really good so let's hop into the next game and let's keep going all right so here we go into the next game now it's going to be a different map i think we've got a few different maps to show you guys but already, you know, just from what I'm seeing, this is a really good start. Um, he's able to get a bunch of boxes over here. Unfortunately, that Max is just going to be chilling. It looks like he's going to do a little bit of teaming with that Max. I don't know if that's a good strategy as a Leon. Max is kind of like a similar brawler. You know, it could kill you from far, it could kill you from close. It has speed. So I can see why he wants to team with the Max. Uh, but it looks like he's kind of just teaming with everyone now. Maybe I'm not too sure. He's doing some spins. Um, you know that Max is shooting a wall. So it looks like they're teamed over there. It looks like teams are forming And you know what? I don't really blame the Leon. Um, I think what he he was doing this entire time Was more or less just trying to not team because it looks like he's not spinning back But if you have seven people spinning 
and then you don't spin, you're the odd one out and you're going to be killed. So I do respect the fact that he's spinning back. There's no way he doesn't lose trophies. And when you're at like 2000 cups, let me tell you, if you come last in showdown, that is like three hours of time wasted. So I don't blame this guy whatsoever. In fact, he does turn on somebody. So he's even going aggro. I'm respecting this gameplay so far. He's chilling with that Max and that Shelly. So it looks like they're going to be teamed up. That Shelly, is that Shelly's name? Tribe Gaming? I think it is. But anyways, you know, he's just doing his thing, spinning on the side. Again, he has a good number of power-ups. If you guys notice, he usually tries to get as many good power-ups as possible. He doesn't want to be the lone man out. He doesn't want to be the one power-up guy, the two power-up guy. He wants to be the thick Leon that nobody wants to turn on. And I do like that strategy. So he's just chilling on the outside. He doesn't really want to involve himself in much. Um, I can see how he's staying away from that Shelly because he doesn't want to be turned on. Even though I don't think he's going to be turned on this early in the game. I can understand the fact that he you know kind of wants to stay away somehow a shelly just died to a mortis which is kind of insane and again he goes aggro he doesn't wait back and he's able to get that kill and secure himself a sixth power up so he's looking very strong probably going to be the last one that people turn on here he's going to turn on that shelly wise move again i respect the gameplay but now both of these guys they want to team up with the leon because the leon is the strongest player this leon's going to spin but that max kind of turned on him Bad decision by that Max. He's probably going to go down. That Shelly's chilling in the bush. If I was that Shelly, I would have just tried to kill that Max. Um, I wouldn't have just stayed there. But, I mean, that Shelly's doing what that Shelly does. Anyways, the Max is going to go down. Shelly's probably going to try and super the, the Leon. But there's nothing really that that Shelly can do. And this is looking like a first place for the Leon. So, let's hop into the next game. And let's keep things going. Okay, so hopping into the next match, he's going to be spawning right beside Amortis. Okay, it's a little bit laggy, but it should be fine. He's going to get that immediate kill. So I believe last game, he got like four kills and assisted on two others. So I'm really respecting this guy's gameplay. He has two kills out of the two people that are in. We can't see how many are left because it looks like this recording is a little bit bugged. But we're just going to assume that there are eight people left because it's pretty early on in the game. But I do love the fact that this guy is going aggro. He is only teaming when he has to team. And I know teaming isn't something that we fully support, but it's something that we can understand. And he's doing a pretty good job. He's even being harassed by these meteors over here. Apparently, the meteors love to take down the Leon. But anyways, he's just chilling. He has his super. He's doing a really good job. That Jackie's just going to hide behind the box like a Jackie should be doing. So he's just chilling down there. But anyways... That Leon is just, you know, pinching away, chipping away, trying to get them low. It looks like he might actually go for that box. Okay, this is a little bit laggy gameplay, so I apologize for that. Not really in my control. Hopefully it fixes, but it looks like they're going to be pinching that Jackie. So if that Leon does secure this kill, and again, this Leon doesn't have to hit full clips. This is something, by the way, that's a really good tip. You guys are seeing he's literally hitting one clip, one bullet at a time. And that is because it was being pinched. You don't have to hit a full clip every time with Leon, although it's possible. And although you do much more damage, you don't have to. You can just slowly chip away and work somebody down. So Leon has now contributed for three kills in this lobby so far. And he only has three power-ups. So you guys can see the aggressiveness that this Leon has. Shelly's going to be able to take out a Gene somewhere around the area. So there's a scary Shelly on the map. Shelly goes into the bush. It's in this Leon's best interest to kind of leave the bush. And that's what he's going to do. Um, you know, you don't want to stay in a bush with a power 8 Shelly with super. That's probable cause for death. Um, if I were this Leon, probably something I would do is would be using my clone right now just to figure out where that Shelly is because the Shelly is obviously the closest target. This is a very, very bad scenario right now for this Leon. And that's exactly what he's going to do. He's going to expose that Shelly. And it looks like he might be able to stay alive. Oh. Oh my god, he's still alive. Okay, he's alive. And he's going to be able to get that kill. Really good kill over there. Now he's just got to stay up. He's going to use his super again. Going to rush that Poco. And this is a fantastic win by that Leon. Really well played. Insane game. About six kills. Let's hop into the last one and let's keep going. Okay, so here we are hopping into the last game. And now that game definitely should earn all of your respect for how this guy is pushing as a Leon very well played it looks like this leon is actually granting this guy a free box maybe i can't tell okay he isn't he was like fake teaming um his name is bot four very interesting name uh but anyways two power-ups right there he gets one kill in the lobby so again he's keeping his aggressiveness he is not going down at all that last game really impressed me for how he won that and again he's using the heal star power which i would definitely recommend in showdown especially it's definitely the stronger star power now but in showdown, obviously, it's really, really good. But anyways, he's getting near that 8-bit. 8-bit used to be the best brawler in showdown. Unfortunately, the homie lost extra life. 
So Leon, I think, is actually part of the meta in Showdown, like a very big part of the meta. Um, but he's just going to be chilling in that bush next to an 8-bit. 8-bit has incredible DPS, so this is a very scary situation, especially if that 8-bit that were to just literally throw his super on top of the Leon and teleport right there. But luckily, he isn't. Five people left in the lobby, so already this Leon is approaching that point where he can't lose too many trophies, so he can afford to go aggressive now. Leon doing the smart thing by just taking out that turret, and you guys can tell he's not going aggressive with his super. Although this Leon is not, you know, spinning around and teaming, and he's not, and he's, you know, he is playing aggressive. He's playing calculated aggressive. He's not just wasting his super, trying to kill everyone. He's taking it slow. He's doing his thing and he's doing very well at it. So he's kind of just chilling right now, you know, going back and forth. Four people left. So now he can afford to go aggro. He's going to go into that middle grass. Maybe if he uses his gadget again, that gadget use is really good for identifying who's closest to you. You can usually find someone hiding if you use it. And usually there are people in the grass. Um, two people in the grass here. Leon starts to spin because he is weak and he isn't really, you know, someone that people are going to prioritize to stay alive. He's kind of on the outer edge. So it looks like two people are going to fight. The Leon might try and third party that and take advantage. He's looking at it, decides not to. Instead, he's just going to play this bot perfectly, slowly, but surely he is trapping the bot and the crow. And this is his time. He's going to pop super. He's going to stay invisible. And this bot is just going to chase this crow around. He's going to use his gadget as a meat shield. And again, this bot is just trolling this crow, even though this crow has 11. Really well played from that Leon, and that is going to be it. But anyways, that is going to be it for the video. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And that Leon, again, very good player. So definitely check out his YouTube channel in the description below. That's going to be it. Again, For don't forget to subscribe, because I don't think I'm going to be able to get this Supercell box ever again, maybe. But anyways, it's going to be it. So I'll see you guys again tomorrow and I will catch you guys then. Peace.